Hey guys, is this better today than last week? A little bit because you just don't know how much pressure I've got on my shoulders for this to work for all of you guys like it is for me. I feel better and better each day. I feel calmer each day. Um, all thanks to our wonderful little treasure here, the villain ball. Now, I've had a lot of questions this week about the villain ball, and I would love to answer some of them. One of the questions, one of the main questions I've had is, does it work for deep brain stimulation? Now, in their instruction book, there is a list of the contraindications um, that may have trouble with it. But it, you have to remember, guys, this is a new device in the last couple of years. It has only been available in European Union countries until now. So a lot of these conditions, they haven't had enough people with those conditions to trial the device. So therefore, they've written them in here to seek your medical advice before using the device for those, um, the precautionary contraindications that they've written here. Now, also, a couple of people wrote to me saying it says in the instructions that you can't use it for head tremor. What it actually says is, the villain ball is not intended for other uses. Cranial application to treat headache in brackets, should not be placed anywhere to induce vibrations in the head area. Then other bracket, close the bracket, head or neck tremors. So when you read it, you're probably skipping lines. You would read the villain ball is not intended for other uses, head or neck tremor or other conditions. What it's actually saying is don't put it on your head or don't put it on your neck. The next sentence it says, it is only to be used as a handheld device to produce local vibration in the upper limb. So please don't put it on your head, don't put it on your neck. Someone did ask me, how do you stop the head tremors? Do you put it on your head? No, this device, all you have to do, it is so simple. You turn it on, you charge it first. Even the charger is magnetic. Our tremors don't have to worry about this charger. It will connect itself. You put it close enough, it's going to connect. You then turn it on. You sit with it in your hand for 10 minutes. It'll do its thing. What it is doing is program, programming itself to your tremors. Then when it stops itself after 10 minutes, you turn it off. You put it in your other hand, you turn it on, you sit there for 10 minutes again. If you've got to get up and walk around, just have your arm close to your body. No big strenuous movements with your arm while you're using the device. After it stops after 10 minutes, you turn it off and that is it. Straight away, you'll feel amazed. I did, but like I said, please watch the video last week to where I explained how it made me feel in the first five days. Now, one another question I keep getting asked is, is it keeping your tremors away and how do you know? Yes, it is. This device to me has reprogrammed my brain somehow to make me realize I don't need these severe tremors anymore. I don't need the head and full body and internal tremors anymore. Um, and I'll tell you how I know. When I was doing my December videos with you, my third birthday cake with you, then the wrapping of the present, then the Christmas Day video, I was trialling this device for those videos. For my third birthday video, I'd only been trialling the device six days. That was the first day I felt incredible. I used it that afternoon. I didn't use it that night because I wanted to see how long it would take for my tremors to come back. I didn't use the device the next morning and I was an hour late for my live 
because it took 19 hours for my tremors to come back to full force. And that was the first time they were allowed to come back other than the horrible first night tremors I had. It's like the ET is finally allowed to escape this barrier that's been hidden over it and it hit me hard for that birthday video. The next one I did with you, the wrapping of the present video, was 12 at 12 days. So it was six days after that. I'd used the device for the six days. I'd stopped using the device 41 hours before that wrapping of the present video. If you watch that video back, I had my arms out from my body. Normally, I have my arms tucked in for everything. You guys know that. I can't do anything. I couldn't even hold this ball normally unless my arms were tucked in. But look at me with my arms flapping in the breeze. In the first couple of weeks, my shoulders were sore because they were so relaxed. I wasn't tense anymore. And it's just amazing. The next video I did with you, so 41 hours and my tremors weren't back to full extreme, but I was a day late, I was an hour late because I thought they would have come back before that and my arms were out. I was talking about the emotions of Christmas, but I didn't have the emotions in me anymore because I'd had a wonderful week while using this device. My next video was my Christmas video. Guys, I stopped using this device on the Thursday before Christmas. Christmas was on the Monday, four days, and my tremors weren't back fully as then for that video. That's why I sat myself off the camera a bit and showed my kids more. My two daughters were more shakier than me on that day, and I hadn't used this device for four days. So to me, that was a trial I was doing it to show that if you go away on holidays or an unplanned trip and you forget the charger and the ball goes flat, you should be right for a few days. You really should. They didn't come back. Every now and then they would try and come back, but then they would calm again. And that was the internals or the head. Even now, the head or the internals, they try and come back for a little bit and then they're gone again. Look at these hands, guys. Someone asked me the other day, how, f how do you realize, how do you, what age do you think your tremors are at now? Because I'd have, I've had ET all, all my life. And I said, I reckon young childhood. My hands were the problem at childhood. At childhood, was when I was tremoring like that, holding a cup. And my mum would say, two hands, sit down, don't spill it, don't spill it. I'd spill it everywhere. Cheers, guys. Like, it has taken me back to my childhood tremors. This has taken 50 years of progression of me. <laughs> and I am amazed. I've always said, if I stop tremoring tomorrow, I will have to relearn how to do everything again. I don't have to relearn every, how to do everything again, but I tell you what, guys, I am so amazed even over a month later. I am still amazed at what my hands can do every day and what my body can do. On my TikTok lives, I'm forever saying, oh, come on, look at this. <laughs> look, how I'm look how easy this is for me to do. This morning, Shane and I went for brunch. I picked up a coffee cup and I said to him, Dal, look at this. I got it to my mouth. I drank it. He said, Dal. The other day, we went, Shane, Emily and I were at his work. I took them lunch and he has those horrible metal see-through stairs to walk up to where he is. I said to him, I'm going to do these stairs. Dal. I hate those stairs. They, I, I'm clinging on, I'm looking down, I'm feeling I'm going to fall through. I, my leg tremors, I used to feel I was going to fall all the time. Shane or Emily had to be behind me or in front of me, whichever way. If I was going down, get in front of me. If I'm going up, get behind me. I said to Shane, you go. And he said, no, no, I'll, I'll, I'll go behind you just in case. And I nearly ran up those stairs. I turned around and was saying to him, Dale, look at this. I'm, and I'm bouncing up them stairs. 
on the top it was the metal wire and I was I would be clung to that railing shaking this whole thing I was amazed and going down the stairs I said to Emily stand back watch this <laughs> every day I am still amazed and I've been using this ball now since the 3rd of December I started using it so over a month I'm still amazed. Yes, I did stop it a few times, but as soon as I picked it back up again, because I'd used it for the full two weeks at first, the three times a day at four hourly breaks. Do not let anyone else hold this device. It programmed to my tremors. And after four days, I could pick it up and it knew who I was and it calmed me straight back down again. Now, I've been getting a lot of questions on, and critics about there's cheaper things out there. Why didn't I find the cheaper things? Guys, cheaper isn't always best. This device has been, this company has designed and made this device. The other one you are finding on Amazon is a cheap rip-off to this. It They even copied the same box and everything. But this one is a certified medical device. This one has the artificial intelligence algorithm that analyzes hand tremors and adapts the therapy, therapy to each patient individually. The cheaper one doesn't. Please. Work it out in the first week and try and get your money back. Now, guys, I have put up the links to these two things. The thing is, if you are worried about it, consult your doctor. The trouble is your doctor may not know about this device as yet because it's only just become available worldwide. These two articles are available on that poll pay on that poll post I put up last night that is on Facebook there is a poll I have put up now guys please be careful with this poll if you scroll past these dots you are going to press one of the buttons already some people have and I'm pretty sure they're by mistake because the devices should be arriving to people the first time either today or tomorrow so it is very easy. Even when I scrolled and I touched this one, it took my dot off that one and put it on this one. I've also got to be careful because if I touch any of these crosses, I'm wiping out one of those poles. Now the pole is, look at this paper. Calm stopped my hand tremors only. Now that also means if you only had hand tremors too. Calmed stopped my head tremor only. Calm stopped my internal tremor only. Calm stopped all of the above tremors. That's me. I've ticked that dot. Then there's did not calm stop all of the above tremors. I only have hand tremors. It did not stop them. So there are your six options. Please only tick one. Please. Only the rigid dig villain ball people mark that poll. If you ordered one of the cheaper versions from Amazon, or like the other critics told me that you can go to the pet shop and buy a $10 cat toy that'll work just as well and I should be sending everyone to that. If that works for you, that is great. Put it in the comments of the poll questionnaire, but do not put it on the poll, please. I want that poll to only be about villain ball for the ETs. Because this is to let all the ETs know how we are going with this and how it helps all the other ETs out there, not just me. So please, if you've got one of the cheaper ones, like I said, write about it in the comments, not a problem, but don't enter the poll for the cheaper one because then it will be mixed results. If you say it didn't work, people will think that's about the villain ball. So just if you can do that, guys. Also, if you do get one, please 
Let me know how you're going in the first couple of days by message, private message. Please let me know. I am dying to know some results. I really am. One last thing before I go. Just to say it all, guys. My arm's out. This little plastic stylus pen that I shouldn't even hold. <laughs> That's the best looking spiral you're ever gonna get from an ET. <laughs> Let's try that again. That says it all. I love you all guys. Take care, stay safe. If you do buy one, don't forget to use the Shaky Nan discount code. You will find the link up the top of this post or in the comments if it's on any of the other sites, not just on Facebook. Um, please use the Shaky Nan discount code. Don't forget the E in Shaky Nan, and it's one word, and you will get 50 euros off that total price as well. I love you all, guys. Take care. Please let me know. I'm dying to know these results. Yes, like I said, I am shaking a bit, but come on. This little tiny fine motor skill is nothing to me without the head tremor. Let's see if I can stop it. The full body tremor. Oh, it's not going to stop now. Normally I can stop it. I'm just so excited. I'm so excited for this, guys. But believe me. It's not tremor operated anymore. There you go, nearly stopped. It's battery operated. But I can't talk because it makes it still shake. <laughs> I love you all, guys. Just look, arms up. I don't get exhausted anymore. Do you know what I did the other day before I go? I shaved my legs with a brand new razor for the first time in years. Last time I shaved my legs with a razor, I shaved from there to there and there to there, just that, and I had 22 cuts. The other day I shaved both of my full legs, not one cut, not even a little nick on the kneecap. I love you guys, take care.